is at Apex Asia 2019, and I'm joined by Amber Jung. How did I do? Yeah. Yeah, well, okay. Um, who works for Google Pay, and she did a, a really interesting um, presentation this afternoon about, I guess, the way that travelers are um, becoming inspired to travel and some of the things they like and don't like. So could you tell us a little bit about um, what, what you've learned or what you shared about travelers' um, behaviors and preferences? Yes, so um, for airlines, like payment is really the last mile. Uh, they've done so much promotion to attract passengers and the passenger goes through all the booking forms and they really want to see that transaction happens. So that's what, how Google Pay fit in. Um, that's like the solution I want to, um, I actually talked about today. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, and you talked a little bit about um, two clicks. Why is it so important that we get the user to the payment portal in two clicks? Yeah, think about last time you book a ticket. Like you have to take credit cards. There are so many steps you have to fill in. And very likely on the very small screen of mobile devices, you're likely to drop out halfway. Mm -hmm. So we don't want that happen, uh, which Google Pay does. It's actually saved all the credit cards the user um, pay a uh, use before and uh, tie under his or her accounts. So next time um, it will just auto populate um, and enable user to check out in two clicks. So it's more streamlined checkout process um, and more frictionless um, experience. Okay, and you talked a little bit about um, some of the airlines that you are already working with. Uh, Southwest, I think, was one of your, your first airline partners, but that's grown since then. So can you just talk about your penetration into the market and what are your goals for the airline industry going forward? So the original use case for Boarding Pass API, um, we partnership with Southwest, and ever since uh, we actually worked cross with a lot of North America Airlines, um, EMEA, APAC, and see a lot of attractions for Android phone users download boarding pass. So last year um, in Asia, we worked with Singapore Airlines and Virgin Australia to launch boarding pass. Um, and we do see this um, like beyond payment, it actually adds value to the whole uh, traveler's experience. Um, so we're very actively screening out to other airlines. Okay, and uh, just finally, at the beginning of your presentation, there was a, a presentation before you uh, for the gentleman from Alipay. Um, do you consider them a competitor, I guess, in the digital payments space? Well, I think uh, I wouldn't put competitors uh, in this sense. Uh, it will be more like a different form of payments. Um, I would say like um, in China, uh, Alipay, WeChat Pay are more popular form of payment. But if we look at global travelers, uh, the most prominent form of payment is still credit card. And what Google Pay does, we, uh, um, our whole infrastructure is on credit card and we help this group of credit card payments users to uh, help them um, get their payment down fast and frictionless. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, super. Well, thank you so much for your time today. Thank you.